So welcome you all. So before getting into the detail, uh, please like this video and subscribe to this channel. So to start with this amazing project, first you need to install the Python code editor. And uh, I'm using using the PyCharm community. You can simply just install, or if you find difficulty in installing that, you can simply just comment uh, below the video. I can make another video for, inst uh, for the installation of the PyCharm community, and what are the uh, other uh, settings for this best use, best settings for this PyCharm community. I will make another video. So simply just open this. So when it opens and here you can see the uh, uh, tab of the new project you can click on this and simply just uh, name a project like uh, what do you want like uh, I have to name my project like Alexa so I simply just name the project and simply just enter So while it is configuring, wait a second. Creating an, another virtual environment, so it will take some time. I think so. So while the project is installing, so uh, what does uh, you first you need to understand what does Alexa do? So basically, Alexa do basically uh, two things. Like first thing, it listens your voice as a command, and uh, it converts your voice into text, and then it uh, searches into the mm, other platforms using the Google API and uh, give you the result in a text form. Uh, if you want in the text form or if you want in the uh, audio form so like that is the voice of a female Alex uh, or like the voice of the Jarvis so before the project is getting ready uh, so here the project is uh, ready to go for in code so simply just uh, uh, clear out this main.py first thing that you need to do is that clear this uh, main.py and then uh, for going into the pro uh, code you just need to install the python 3 basic uh, pi uh, 3 basic libraries on the python that is with uh, let me just open the chrome and show it out over here simply just type py search recognition that will recognize your speech so simply just click on the first link and here is the command so here you can copy click on the copy to clipboard and open the terminal and here you can simply just paste and enter it will install the package same for the next package you just need to do python text to speech click on the first link and click copy to clipboard on the and simply just paste on the terminal and just enter and the third library that we will going to uh, install is that pi audio so in pi audio some system will uh, show error uh, while installing because of the upgraded version of the python so let me show you the error so here is the pi audio and here is the command for the third library while it is installing so here you can paste and you can you will see the error that mostly occurs in many systems so here you can see so to avoid this error you can use the other command for the third library that is install no, pip install sorry pip install pip win uh, another command is that pip win install by audio and then enter it will simply just install to avoid the error we have used the two commands 
don't worry i will uh, provide the all the commands in the description box you can check it out there so our first uh, task is to talk with the alexa and to talk she has to understand so you have to import speech recognition first we you have to put it down and here you can import speech recognition as ek speech recognition as ek or se or eric whatever you want to do name it so if i i have to so we just i have to name it as, as ek so and we will give it as a time like ek and once the ek is available you need to create a listener which is equal to like uh, listener which is equal to ek dot recognizer and that will recognize your voice and after that you need to put something in the try block so or uh, sometime microphone will not work or give you uh, some trouble other trouble so that's why it is the try block and uh, once you created the try block you need to create the other accept block and if you do not want to do anything but that accept is just simply write pass let's say pass and uh, that means python will ignore uh, not to do anything when the exception happens uh, then in the try block uh, we will use a microphone uh, so we just type with equals to ek dot microphone source and after this you need to so here the listener listens to a voice wait a second what is this error is showing accepted wait a second So after that we need to create another variable that voice equals to listener that listens a voice as a source. So your listener listens to your voice. All uh, near you are doing is that you are using a microphone as a source and then calling this a speech recognizer to recognize. Uh, to listen to source, the once you have the source, you can use a lot of functions. At this uh, speech recognizer that had to convert voice to text. So here, uh, moving forward, uh, we will declare a variable called command, and command, and the value of that would be equals to listener dot recognizer no 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 listener dot recognizer dot underscore google by using the google api and then you will pass the voice and after that you will need to print the command in the output section so once you have gone through this part, you then uh, need to run. So wait a second. You can just simply run this. Alexa. So here you can see it is printing the voice in the text. So so wait a second. I can find an issue if we run this program that we don't recognize. Where the name, so we have to just uh, 
Lower and then if Alexa in command then it will print the command else not like so we just run this program. Alexa, how are you? So here you can see it is uh, printing the command. Alexa, how are you? Because it contains Alexa, and now we can run the another test case. How are you? It will not print until until and unless you can you include this Alexa in your voice. So after this. So this way, wait a second to write. Printed that Alexa is listening. No, that uh, the program is Alexa. How are you? So you can here you can see it is printing the same as exact program. So after that, then you can do much more fun trying by using this if condition, like if it's contained the name Alexa, like or something that you want to detect Alexa is mentioned in your voice or not, and uh, you can do a simple thing uh, like just. Uh, include now let's try um, it is printing the only the text format uh, if you want to hear it uh, by the voice so wait you see i don't see it first let me check the another test case without including the alexa name how are you so you can see you see, I don't see uh, it as an output when not calling the word Alexa in my voice. That means whenever I call the uh, call, uh, whenever I speak, I have to mention the word Alexa. Then it will give the output, and it does it. It does passes. So let's go to the next chapter. If I am taking, uh, then she also talk to me with. So simply just for Python text to. We have to import the second package that is Python text to speech. And we need to import the another package in that is that Python text to speech. Let's create the engine that will speak up to you. In it, <coughs> wait a second. What engine dot say? We have to say. I am Alexa. What can can I do for you? Engine dot run it. So, we just run this code. I am Alexa. What can I do for you? So, here you can... Uh, Alexa, what's your day? Uh, what's your uh, day? Wait a second. Stop and rerun. I am Alexa. What can I do for you? Uh, hello Alexa, how are you? 
so so here you can see here you can hear that uh, it is a voice of the male so uh, we have to convert into female it just requires in two lines of the code so we just need to go in the voices voices property voices equals to engine dot get property voices engine dot set property voice we will shift the voice index to the second position that is one already I am Alexa. What can I do for you? <laughs> Hello Alexa, how are you? So here you can see the voice of the female uh voice of the male uh converts into female voice in just writing these two quotes. So you can see. So next part uh, in the next part we will continue with this project. So that was for today. So see you in the another video.